Yo, what up, man? It's Cassius Bricks, and I'm about to vent. You heard? What's good? Okay, that, so, I mean, with your son, like, I mean, when you think about it, does it just, like, does the creativity just start to flow as soon as you think about, like, the love that you have for your son? Are there words that can encapsulate? You understand what I'm saying? Yeah. As a as a wordsmith, as somebody that puts words together, are there words that can encapsulate like the love that you do have for your child? Um, no, I just think it's so natural. Like I could just turn it yeah. off and whenever. Like I, I could be talking some gritty shit or, or some just having fun with it, and I'll mention my kid somehow. Mm -hmm. So it's just natural. Like I don't. I can mention him on any song, like it could be commercial, it could be a dance song. I might slip it in there somehow, <laughs> and it'll just go with it. <laughs> yeah. So what is um? If somebody asked you what it's like to be a father, what would you? Um, how would you explain it? Um, it's a learning experience. Uh -huh. It's like reflecting on yourself, I believe, as mm -hmm. well. Because sometimes I look at my son and be like, "Damn, I used to do that," or like. I remember when my pops did this with me and shit mm -hmm. like that. So it's like it's like a learning experience. It's like a reflection. It's like a test, you know. Have you? Does being a father has it made you more forgiving of your parents' mistakes? Um, a little, just a little bit, <laughs> not too much. <laughs> yeah, I still was fucking up here. I wouldn't have did that. <laughs> okay, but it does um, give you a little sympathy. Um, yeah. So, um, your father actually recently passed. Yeah. Yeah, my condolences. Um, no problem. Um, how long ago was that? I would say about two months. It's some change, yeah. So, it's still a bit fresh. Yeah. Um, what I noticed is, um, you kind of picked up and you went to work, you know, yeah. after, like, it was a, it was definitely like a little bit of a grieving period and then you just, you know, you got yeah. to it. Yeah. Um, is the get into it, is it? Um, a matter of you not processing it or is it I mean like you're, you're running from it or it's a matter of this might be what he would have wanted I think kind of running from it mm -hmm. because if I could just if I was to sit in grief and be at home or at work and this shit would drive me crazy mm -hmm. so I'm like alright to get my mind off this shit I'm gonna just do what I gotta do mm -hmm. it helps it helps okay then um, was it a surprise was it a surprise you said? Yeah, um, yeah, um, your father's yeah, passing. It was, it was, it was a surprise because I was supposed to leave the day after for a show in Boston, mm -hmm. an event I was going to host, and it was just like crazy how the universe works, and um, it's like, damn, what if I would have left? Like, what if it would have happened the next day I would have been on the, on the bus, or I would have had to turn all the way back around, and... It's crazy how life works, and then the event got postponed anyway, mm -hmm. and I was just with him. I was the last person with him, last person to see him talk and breathe and all that. So. Wow, wow, that's um, yeah. that's pretty heavy. Yeah. Um, does it inspire like new work? Has it inspired new work or? Yeah, it definitely does. I just, I'm like, damn, like I'm getting old. Shit is happening. Mm -hmm. It's time to get busy. I've been wanting to get busy, but it's like now the person that told me everything is gone, and all I have is you know me and, and siblings and, and my yeah. kid and my mom's. So it's like I gotta mm -hmm. be that, that that next one for the legacy and just go hard. Mm -hmm. How did he feel about your career, your rap career? You know these West Indian Because <laughs> <laughs> If I it ain't one. making money, they don't respect that ain't it. it. But he was an entrepreneur himself, wasn't he? Yeah, he was. Now, I'm, I'm pretty sure, like, out the gate, didn't, he wasn't making money. Right, right. So he didn't get, like, the... He still didn't get the dream of it. Right. He, it was like, oh, you going to do a show? You mm -hmm. getting paid? <laughs> you getting perks? They give you drinks? They give you food? I'm like, I said, don't just go like that. He should have been your manager. <laughs> he might have negotiated it. Some, <laughs> been some Joe Jackson shit. Yeah. <laughs> Listen, KB ain't coming out. <laughs> he ain't coming out. <laughs> Unless there's some drinks involved. Like, what's or going derbs. on? Yeah. <laughs> or dirt. Exactly.